In 2009 in southeast Queensland, Redland City community members came together to discuss the future of the Runnymede project. Purposes. That's the reason for today's discussion. Work out what that community purpose is and then move into the next stage. Hi there, Colin Thompson. I'm not a member of anything. <laughs> I am just one of the people in the community who believe if you want to have change, you need to be part of it. this community kitchen, this idea of the kitchen is the hearth of, you know, life. You could uh, sell the idea of coming here to learn how to do this to people all over Australia. The arts must be involved and this involves performance and training and particularly with young people. Overarching themes our group decided on was that um, the project would need to be sustainable and that would that acknowledges that quadruple bottom line approach so it's um, environmentally sustainable it's got social sustainability, um, it's economically sustainable and the governance of it is also sustainable. So that it would offer an educational function. The third theme of being, it being community centred, the need for it to be flexible and future, you know, thinking about the future, the future needs of, um, of our you know, immediate area here in Redlands. The site will reflect our diversity, involving all members of the community, um, acknowledging our multicultural and our Indigenous heritage here in Redlands. And a creative cultural use and the fostering of what's called creative cultures. And then we talked a little bit, a little bit about money makers and um, we thought that obviously the business incubator is a, a good potential money maker. Um, the nursery space would be good, a great place for courses. The markets could generate money as well as the leasing. And then we kind of thought about some synergies between music and the arts. And we actually Post finally, can I thank everyone who has come to actually, again, be part of this. I think they deserve a clap. <laughs> From the facilitators.